Hello everyone, this is John. Welcome back to another review here in the car. And I apologize if there's anything wrong with this video. Uh, Clarity-wise, I find I've pressed the wrong button. Because currently my eyes are dilated and I can't see anything, uh, any clarity that's closer than the distance of my hand. It's also why I have these special glasses on because another thing when you dilate your eyes is that any type of light or sun is very sensitive. So in order to be able to actually drive myself home from the eye doctor, I had to wear these. And if I take them off, this overcast sun will still be too bright for my eyes. Anyways, where am I today? I'm at... T-Bell, Taco Bell, and this is the Double Steak Grilled Cheese Burrito, and I got the Spicy Edition. The only difference in the Spicy Edition is they put jalapenos on the exterior. And you have, this is actually double wrapped. I think that's part of the, the grilled cheeseification. It is a little bit of grilled cheese on the corner of that. But this wrapper, I think they put this around it to keep the cheese from sticking to the grill. So you see on this flap of the wrapper, there's cheese still stuck to it. This side is bald, but this side has cheese and there's a little green speck. I think that might be where the jalapeno is. Um, hopefully there's more than one there. I got this in the big box, so I'm not sure how much it costs by itself. Look it up. Don't be lazy. Anyway, I'm just here to tell you how it tastes. Take a bite. Mm. It's got that beef jerky looking steak. This is blurry or not, can't tell. Looks like it's got rice. Those uh, red uh, tortilla little pieces. Still got a little crunch to them. The grilled cheese in is really what you're here for. And it doesn't disappoint. You definitely get that caramelized cheese flavor. As for the interior steak, like I said, it's got that beef jerky look to it. double, triple, quadruple the steak, still the same kind of steak. And that is that it's a uh, slightly subpar. Hmm. There must be some sour cream on that tip because I got a little drip. I can actually see a little bit of it starting right here, more than halfway through the burrito. The dreaded sour cream pocket. There's rice, cheese sauce. Sour cream that'll drip on you from the back end. They might not have given me the spicy one because I've yet to bite into a jalapeno.
more of the, the red tortilla flakes. Okay, into the end, into the, the sour cream pocket. Nothing else hidden. There's a bit of a spicy sauce in there. I'm not sure if that's exclusive to the spicy one. Mm, these uh, grilled cheese bits. They peel right off of this parsley. And they're really, really tasty. So, again, the best part about this is the grilled cheese portion. And it still it does come in a seasoned beef variety, so you don't have to get the, the steak version if you don't want. Um, but the steak version is not bad. It's just uh, you know what kind of quality steak you're going to be getting from the the Taco Bell. Anyway, I don't recommend or not recommend this one. It's something that uh, I'll leave up to your choice. It's not bad, but it's not the best. Uh, I think if I were to get it again, I'd get just the seasoned beef kind. Um, I don't think the the quality of steak there is enough to do the upcharge. The ground beef is probably just as disappointing. Anyway, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you were the one that uh, commented that I should try this one. This video is for you. And if you have another suggestion for me to go out and try something else from anyone out there, go ahead and leave a comment down below. We'll see you on the next video. Maybe I won't have any glasses on then at all. Bye.